Hi, I'm Kerry. I'm the host of Best of Us Investors. We're a tribe, uh, a group of people who have a common interest in making money in the stock market, and we share our ideas. In fact, I wrote a book about it, The Power of the Tribe. It's available in the, in the description below. And what we're trying to do is, I guess the easiest way to explain it is we're trying to duplicate a quantum computer. And that is to say we're trying to put millions of minds together to help us make better investment decisions. Well, as a result of the tribe, and we meet at our Discord, and if you want to get involved with that, just go to bestofusinvestors.com, and I'll send you a link to the Discord. But my tribe has put me on to a couple of stocks that uh, are, are advancing in the area that I'm very interested in, and that is that is the delivery of medicine. I think the coronavirus has um, has just escalated the the awareness that our medical system is broken, that we don't uh, let people know early enough that there's a problem going on in their body and they need help, and then we don't have the cures we need. And as a result of genome sequencing and uh, genome editing, and just the the knowledge that has has, uh, has evolved out of the crisis, th the industry is changing. And one of the changes is that artificial intelligence is finding its way there. And as a result of that, my tribe has put me onto two stocks. One is called Shred Shred Schrodinger. Um, S-D-G-R, and the other one is Accelera, and that's A-B-C-L. And I'm buying them both, and um, so my tribe members said, hey, uh, what is, what's the difference? What's the difference between these two stocks, and which one, if I can only buy one, should I buy? So I've been spending my time uh, the last couple of days trying to figure out because I'm not a scientist, nor am I your financial advisor. Um, I, I want to figure out what's the difference. Are they duplicating each other? Do I need to own both of them? And that's what this video is all about. What's the difference between um, Schrodinger and Accelera? And I'm going to explain it to you as I understand it, but I'm not a scientist, nor am I your financial advisor. I'll be right back. Best of Us Investors presents Kerry Griegmeier. Okay. First of all, you got to understand artificial intelligence. I think the easiest way to, 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 to understand it is what is intelligence? Intelligence is what I've got. I've accumulated it over the last 76 years, and it's what I know. Uh, it's my knowledge. All right, what is artificial intelligence? Well, when I have a question, uh, I, I, I open up my phone and I go to Google and I ask my phone a question and Google gives me an answer. That's artificial intelligence. It has just taken the world of knowledge and made it available to me, okay? So that's artificial intelligence as I interpret it. What's machine learning? As the, 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 my phone will give me an answer. As I page down on my Google search, though, I'll find a series of like questions. That's machine learning. That is that Google, through its algorithm, took my intelligence, gave me an answer based on all the intelligence in the system, in, in their search category, and then said, Carrie, here's maybe a better question to ask, and here's the answers there. That's my interpretation of machine learning. Uh, what's the next step is, I guess the next step is, before I ask the question, they give me the answer. So, but we go back to, um, what's the difference between uh, Schrodinger and Accelera. They're both using um, machine learning and artificial intelligence to improve the means by which 
pharmaceutical companies can discover drugs to 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 cure our diseases, to uh, treat us for anything that might go wrong with it. So, first of all, let's talk about uh, Schrodinger. Back in nineteen in twenty sixteen, um, scientists wreck it with the help of Microsoft recognized they could build molecules. Now, the word molecule took me back to my senior high school class in chemistry, which I had to take. Um, and I remembered about uh, atoms and electrons and how atoms come together to form molecules. Well, back in 2016, scientists realized they could, they could manufacture molecules. Okay, so then fast forward to 2021, they now know that they can maneuver, manipulate, and make more molecules, and then by searching these atoms and putting them together, they can create drugs to help us. And Schrodinger developed the software to do this and has then made that software available to the 20 largest pharmaceutical companies, which all signed up to make, to help them make drugs faster. This process used to be a four to six year process. They've now got it down to a two to three year process from developing from taking a billion possible molecules that not only are in existence but manufacturable and bringing it down to a thousand molecules that then they can do fur further simulations on and create our the drugs we need okay so that's what Schrodinger does all right then we go to uh, Accelera. It, develop, it develops antibodies based on the antibodies and drugs based on the antibodies that are already in our system. In other words, it takes the knowledge of the lab technicians and puts it into a database and then compares the, each lab technician's work to accelerate the finding of drugs. Okay, Schrodinger works on molecules. Accelera has a software that helps pharmaceutical companies take their lab work and speed up the process to develop drugs. Now, Accelera also has a very unique business system. They, they work with the same 2024 pharmaceutical companies, but they sell them the software at cost and then participate in the royalties and the profits from the drugs that they manufacture. Again, a very unique business plan. Uh, so, Along this lines, as I'm researching to find out what, what's the difference, do I want to own them both, are they in competition with each other, I now know the difference, I now know they're not in competition, I come across this article dated August the 3rd, which is yesterday, and they have gone in collaboration with Tacron, and what Tacron has done or what they they have done for Tacron is found an antibody that targets tumor cells that are growing in our body and they have created a an antibody that will stop that growth of that tumor and revolutionize the area of cancer treatment so my daughter died of cancer my mother died of cancer. Uh, with my daughter's case, I, we went through chemotherapy. I understand chemotherapy. Chemotherapy is bombard the body to kill anything that looks like 
uh, a, gr a growth in your body. That is why when you take chemotherapy, you lose your hair, you lose your, your fingernails, um, because those are the things that are still growing in our body. What chemotherapy does is kills anything and everything else in the body that's growing. And what's growing is cancer. So, and, and the body doesn't have the ability, the T cells, to kill it. Now, with CRISPR, that's changing. What these people have come up with is something probably not as drastic as CRISPR and not as far-fetched or far into the future as CRISPR to something that is maybe within the year. So that, in essence, um, tech, T-A-C-H-R-O-N, Tecron and Accelera will be partnering as a result of Accelera's artificial intelligence injection into the work that Tecron has been doing for the last several years. That's how I see it. Okay, so I have bought both of these stocks. I, in fact, I had Accelera and I've added to my positions there and I'm building a position in um, uh, shredding your SDGR. This is what I want to. This is what I want to invest in. This and this is how I want to invest. I'm not relying on someone who wants to charge me two thousand dollars a month for their tips, or a mutual fund or an ETF where I pay a um, a one percent fee for under management to do their to do their work or be as i say in a mutual fund or etf i want to create a network of people what i call our tribe that feeds me this information i also then within this tribe have an investment committee that analyzes the information that i provide and that they provide and we then we then share that information with the tribe before we share it with you. That's just basically the way it goes. So then, as I'm accused of, I pump these stocks, just like right today. I'm pumping ABCL and I'm pumping SDGR because I own it, because my tribe owns it. And we want, and we got, we learned about it before you did, but now we're making that information available to you. And we know that we learned about it before Goldman Sachs did, before, in many cases, Kathy Woods did, because we've got more minds working on this than they do. And we don't have the restrictions upon us that they do, such as they can't buy ABCL. Kathy Woods can't buy it because it's an over-the-counter stock. Goldman Sachs can't buy it because it's a thinly traded stock. If they told all their billion-dollar customers about it, they'd end up owning the whole damn thing. And they can't take that risk. They can't take the risk. They can't put themselves in that vulnerable position. I can. My tribe can. And that's why we've got an advantage. And that's why my portfolio was up 60% last year and is up 22% thus far this year. And the way that the world is learning now about CRISPR and the revolution within the healthcare field, I am confident my portfolio will be up 50% this year and then even be up higher in the future years because I have discovered what most people have yet to discover. We are in a healthcare revolution. This is bigger than the digital revolution. These companies will be bigger than Amazon. These companies will be bigger than Tesla. Why? because it's going to save our lives. Which would you rather have? A Tesla for $75,000 or your grandchildren's life? Which would you rather have? So which do you think is going to grow exponentially? 
Okay, excuse me for getting so excited, but this is going to change my life and yours. And all you got to do is wake up. Come join us at the tribe. Come to Best of Us Investors. And I don't want you to just come and be a leech. I want you to come and share your knowledge and share your experience and help us grow. All right. I'll talk to you again tomorrow, I'm quite sure, because I'll discover something else. My tribe will tell me something else.